Hey, hey, welcome to the swamp. I'm Load Toad. Last episode, we met an untimely end at the hand of a malicious cargo container. Pesky little bugger decided to trick me by showing its fuse to be fresh and new. No sooner did I open the door that the 25-second timer went off. Well, in all honesty, due to poor judgment on my part, I parked too close to the trees and ended up getting all blowed up, losing everything on my person as well as some hard-earned loot uh, that I gained throughout the episode. Uh, not, not, to, not to mention actually losing my person. And I also lost the Mad Maxed Hellrider truck. So, oh, one moment, please, as I take care of my little friend. And. Ah! One more time. And. Ah! Okay. And. Ah! On the head. On the head. Arr! Come on. Ah! That's right. That's right. Arr! Who's your daddy? Who's. Ah! Who's your. Daddy, that's me. Uh. <sighs> okay. All right. I think there's another one really near, close by. I think through there. But anyway, uh, it's it's all gonna be all right. There's no doubt. It's all it's all gonna be all right. This episode, we're on several pro, uh, several pronged mission to reclaim what we lost. Hello. <laughs> pull, pull, ah, and pow, bam, bramo, ah, one more, ah, on the head, ah, in the gut, oh, in the chest, one more, ah, down you go. Okay, so, <laughs> all right. To do our several prong mission to reclaim what we lost, uh, we need weapons, bobby pins, and screwdrivers along with a hiking backpack. Of course, any targets of opportunity that lay before us will force us to weigh the risk versus reward in front of us. Um, oh, we have another truck already standing by at our homestead. We've got some weapons to replace the ones we lost, and we've got some clothing to help protect us. So let's get after it and make an episode. Finally made it home without incident. Thank goodness. Uh, well, there's our uh, there's our little garden, and uh, what the no no way it's a hell rider bike. <laughs> <laughs> That's from the Hell Rider uh, uh, update back in I don't know what was it um, point five I think. But anyway, uh, there's actually some room in that one too, so you can store some stuff as you raise hell. So I'm just gonna run up here and grab our black truck that uh, I put on the incline up here in case it didn't want to start. And um, we're going to take it into our homestead and we're going to fill it with a few choice things. I'm also going to get uh, a bit geared out and uh, maybe do a little bit of work around the, uh, the homestead. As you can see, we've done a bit of work. Um, I don't know, about a, I guess I'm about a third of the way, maybe a quarter of the way uh, done with what I want to do with it. Uh, but I'll just I'll just keep plugging it away a little at a time um, in hopes that as things progress that you'll be able to see quite a bit of, of change and also uh, in our security uh, around the place. So it is nearly pitch black out here, so when I do my editing, I'm going to attempt to. Uh, uh, get this thing going where it needs to to be uh, okay <laughs> the other thing is I, I wanted to just say real quick is um, I forgot to start recording just as soon as uh, I got up here to the drop I opened up the doors already and I opened this uh, <laughs> this door up 
And um, look what I have found. None other than the VHS-2, and I think it's called a bullpup. And there's uh, there's two versions of it. Uh, this one here. Um, well, I don't I don't know the difference really between the two. I think one's more of a sniper uh, than this one. This is more of an assault. But uh, anyway, it uses the same as the uh, the M16, the um, 5.56 by 45 millimeter ammo. Um, and also of note is that since it's a VHS. It will also play back those old movies that uh, you were watching when you were much, much younger. Just moving from a safe place across the street, I thought uh, that maybe, just maybe, we could see this, uh, this lovely cargo drop explode. Um, you know, since it likes to do so on top of my head, I thought we'd do it from a safe distance. So let's uh, let's just check it out and um, let's enjoy the show. Three, two, one. <laughs> Holy moly! I love it. At the police station now, what we're gonna do is go on in and get ourselves some bobby pins. We don't have a, uh, a whole lot of uh, time to just be, uh, you know, gallivanting around, so we're gonna try to get this done as quick as we can uh, so that we have stuff to, uh, uh, to go to cargo drops and such uh, and get some, some real loot. Uh, but on the other hand, this, uh, this police station might have some stuff in their lockers as well. So let's just uh, keep our fingers crossed. Now, that was a really, really good um, looting experience here at the police station. Uh, four boxes of, uh, of bobby pins. We turned them into uh, to lock picks and uh, opened up everything they had in there. Got a lot of ammo, a gun, lots of good clothing and such. Now we're really in good shape that we can go ahead and go after our... Um, our cargo drops uh, with reckless abandon, I might add. And speak of the devil, look at that. Okay, okay. <laughs> let's uh, let's check it out. <laughs> I'm so I'm so excited. I can't even drive. Okay, nice and easy. 
Check it out nice and easy. Don't get caught. All right, it, it doesn't look like a, a full a full wick, but uh, one can never tell in this game. So uh, get ready to run. All right, and oh, yes. Okay, all right, let's check these out. Oh my word, I got the AWM sniper rifle. That sucker is an absolute beast. It fires the 338 round. Uh, it's also got a uh, bipod that uh, whenever you lay down, you get that extra stabilization. Oh, oh man, I am just over, over the moon. This is an incredible find. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's take all this stuff down to our house and uh, get everything uh, sorted out and such. And then we'll head back up to uh, the town in hopes of finding a uh, another backpack because we're in sore need of this. So um, I will see you in just a little bit. Now, I don't know about the rest of you, but uh, I thought that was rather refreshing. Um, <laughs> again, bowling for dollars. Okay, let's look for... Oh, one second. Let's see if I can... It's been a while since I've used uh, this bow. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. All right, good. And yes, okay, all right. Yeah, I was uh, beginning to wonder if the crossbow uh, maybe dimmed my abilities. So, okay, now we're on our way to look for a backpack because that's the uh, that's probably the major thing that we're lacking right now. So, uh, wish me luck. Here we go. I uh, I guess you could call that. Anticlimactic, yeah. Let's uh, oh, something. Here you are. Hello, hello. Uh, wait. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, wrong. Just move out of the way. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh my word. What am I doing? Oh. 
Okay. Um, you didn't see anything. I'm doing great. All right. Let's go. All right. Let's see what we got in here. Ah, okay. I forgot all about this truck. So um, if I can just uh, remember as uh, time goes by that it's here, then I can go ahead and move it down to the house and we'll be good to go. So what we're going to need to do is um, we'll need to fuel it up and put... So, oh, look at that, a screwdriver. Anyway, we'll need to fuel it up, uh, charge it up, and uh, try to get this thing going. So, uh, But in the meantime, uh, the number one priority is to get that backpack. All right, just seeing uh, where to where to start. Where to start? Wait, wait, wait a second. Let me start at the very beginning back here, and um, we'll make our way. Uh, what is that? Um, east, I guess. Okay, not a lot in uh, in this area right now. So um, I'm uh, fixing to. Uh, Way <laughs> oh yeah, we got our backpack, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, um, let's uh, let's pack it up and uh, go towards our next mission, shall we? Awesome, we got three screw or uh, three sets of screwdrivers, uh, enough for like eight. Uh, wait a second, there's a drop over here. Uh, let's see, get turned right, right there. Okay, all right. So let's uh, let's head on over there and uh, see what's in store for us. But, oh my word! Lately, these drops have just been giving out some incredible items. Um, very very happy with what we have been getting uh, and trying to rebuild our our uh, I don't know our arsenal, our <laughs> our tools, our clothing, all that stuff. So. Um, Lots of lots of uh, screwdrivers, lots of uh, lots of bobby pin. All right, so this is our first one. Let's take a look, and uh, who knows? And oh, unbelievable! Okay, um, here we've got uh, the short military pants. We've got um, the hat and. A sweater and a backpack to put them all in. So let's uh, see what else we can do. This is looking better and better. Okay, and what do we have? Are you kidding me? One, two, three, four, five screwdrivers and two crowbars. Mine. Next on the agenda. Come on, baby. Open up the key. Okay. Success and oh, okay. So we got some rebar cutters and uh, electrical toolkit. Okay, very nice. Okay, open says me. Oh, close enough. All right, and ah, huh, another chainsaw. Well, they just uh, they're everywhere. I think this is like number three or four for me. I think it's three. That I have. Wow. Okay. All right. Open a little more. There we go. All right. And I've got. Oh, nice! A tire repair kit and a vehicle repair kit. So very much needed items. Okay. And let's see. What's this last one? Here? And we have. Oh, okay, the 1911, a uh, uh, bunch of magazines, a suppressor, and a couple of boxes of uh, 45 ammo. I am, uh, I'm very happy with that. Now, I'm getting, uh, I'm getting low on water as well, so we need to go down by the bridge that's really close to our place, and um, I don't know if I can fill up the water containers that I have are not down there but I do know that I need to uh, I need to drink so uh, I'll uh, I'll see you down there yeah it's just a hop skip and a jump 
just uh, go on either either side. It seems easier to me to um, just either go. Well, it's it's relatively easy to go down either side uh, to get to get your water. Uh, the only thing you have to watch out for is uh, puppets surprising you. So anyway. Oh, okay. Well, this uh, this takes care of uh, one aspect. Um, now we're just going to need to be able to, to feed ourselves. Um, it looks like that we're going to also need to do some hunting later on in this season. Um, not today. <laughs> We've already had a pretty busy day. But uh, anyway, we got the water out of the way. And uh, let me head on back up to the truck. Got in the truck. Uh, I noticed that there's a drop up. Oh, are you? Okay, there's another truck. Well, there's a drop. <laughs> there's a cargo drop right up this way, and I'm just trying to spot him right now. There it is. There's the smoke. Okay, I'll see you up there. Holy moly! Do you know what this is? This is a World War II bunker, and <laughs> and the cargo drop dropped right there. Okay, this is uh, this is cool. Okay, we got 25 minutes to go through here, so we need to just kind of be careful as uh, we're walking around up here because puppets could be anywhere. They could be inside. They could be just outside, which they're want to do. Um, okay, I'm uh, I'm overly excited. This is our uh, this is our first one together, so uh, I'm I'm very happy uh, about this. So let's uh, it's a little bit dark, a little bit darker. Weather's starting to change a little bit. So okay, all right. These are always open, and uh, normally they. Uh, they give you ammo, which is always nice. Um, oh, well, there's one that's empty. A shuriken. I don't entertain those at all. Okay, there's a magazine. Okay, good. Next we have... Oh, uh, look at the, the bubbling up going on on the floor of the graphics. Uh, once in a blue moon it does that. I'm not the only one that, that, uh, that this happens for... Uh, to, but uh, it's, it's I don't know if it's unsettling but it's irritating I'll tell you that oh look at look at this okay so we have an 1897 okay got a box of ammo good good all right let's see what else here that shotgun is going to come in real handy. Uh, are you... <laughs> oh, my word. It's another one. So I can use the other one to rebuild this one. All right. Let me uh, just put them both down in an area that uh, I know will, will be safe, at least until I get out of here. But, man, I hate that bubbling. Ugh. Okay. So... I don't like to run through these things in, just in case of a, uh, a puppet sleeping or resting or whatever the heck they do. But, uh, I mean, it is what it is. I just don't want to run into them. Okay, almost done. Just about finished. And that's it. Okay. So, let's go and uh, get our, our two... Uh, our two weapons, and we'll uh, we'll carry them out. Put one up here, and the other one I'll just carry, and uh, run those out, and um, put them in the truck, and then we'll uh, we'll check out the uh, the cargo drop. So I always look forward to these. Yeah, never know what you're gonna get. Do, do me good, do me good. 
What do we have? What do you have? Oh, okay, a 40U screwdriver. Nice. Okay. And we have Oh Tux water, soda, milk, pop, whatever you want to call it. Outstanding. I'll never go thirsty again. Alright, what does Lady Luck have for me now? Well, not that. That's, uh, yeah. Put that back. Yeah, I don't want to use that until um, I use the smaller ones out. Alright, here we go. Come on. Come on. Success. Ah, a grenade. Gonna blow somebody up. come in handy when we go to uh, to start up the uh, the car we we choose okay is that the yeah I want to get the smaller might as well go ahead and use those up versus the full 40 so here we go okay and we have oh my word <laughs> we got the sawed-off shotgun with two whole boxes of rounds for this thing. Oh, 40 shells. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. Be still. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Antibiotics, vitamins, and uh, the hemostat. All of your medical needs for when we need it. And uh, in this game, and the way I play, yeah, I'm going to need them. Yeah, I'm going to put everything in uh, gonna put everything in the truck. And uh, we're going to go back to that red truck. And um, we're going to prepare to bring it home with us. Might have to do some leapfrogging, but dadgummit, we're going to bring her home. It's a, a guy right over here. So uh, let's see how close I can get. I wanted a little bit of close-up action. Ah. Come here. Ah. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> That's right. That's right. You're mine. Hello, little puppet all by yourself. That's right. Come here. Come here, you. Ha ha! Oh, shoot. Oh! It's treachery! Ambush! Oh, oh my word! Oh! 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 Okay. One down, one down, one down. Come on. Oh! Wow. I need to dance! Oh! oh. <laughs> I'm getting my ass kicked! Wait! I'm. Ah! Come on, just one more. Oh, my word! I'm getting the tar kicked out of me here. Oh, 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 nice. Oh, holy smokes. Oh, look at my head. All you can see is a glowing skull. I'm the red skull. Oh, look at me. Oh, oh, my word. I'm just reeling for this. 
Oh, and my head. My God, it's full of stars. I, I feel so cold. Okay, I'm going to take care of myself. And then I'm going to go back to the house. We'll see you soon. I hope. Is, is there no end to the carnage? Notice what I have in my hand. Yes, it is a pistol. And, you know, the question that comes to mind is, why didn't I use the pistol to take out those puppets? I, I, have, I don't have an answer for you. I'm only one toad. But, um... Ah, uh, what a what a trip, and and then to come home to to this to this macabre dance. Okay, so let's go down, and I know that there's one more. I just want to take care of him, and uh, just just be done with them, so that we can call it a an episode. Hello, come on. Come on. And. Yes. Okay. Ah. Look, I hit him so hard, I knocked his shirt off. My friends, what an episode. We got some serious firepower now, so those puppets are just gonna have to go. We're gather we are gathered. We gathered exactly what we set out for a backpack. Check. Four boxes of bobby pins, check. Screwdrivers and crowbars, check, check. And finally, in our own personal scenario of the Kobayashi Maru, we were ambushed by not one, not two, but three public puppets. <laughs> puppets laying in wait for us to rescue an additional second truck in case we run into another smart alecky cargo container. It was an epic battle, but we won the day. Hey, thank you all so much for visiting the channel and see what we're up to. If you like what you saw, smash that like button. If you want to be notified of more of my content as it comes out, then by all means, subscribe. As our Scottish neighbors of this old earth might say, may the blessed sunlight shine on you like a great peat fire so that stranger and friend may come and warm himself at it. And may peace and plenty bless your world forever. And as always, this old toad wants you to keep your nose to the wind and your tail to yourself. Ribbit, baby!